two sides to how I'm feeling about not making this one. What up, what up, what up, my dance babes? Welcome back to another video with your girl, HBCU Dance Teams. If that is something that you are interested in, make sure you like this video up, throw a comment down below, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. If you are new to my channel, welcome to the game, welcome to the dance team, and if you are a returning subscriber, you already know what's about to go down so you guys see that beautiful thumbnail and that beautiful title i am back with another finger so guys today we are going to be talking about asu well former asu staying at and former dd4l dancing doll from the hit show bring it princess i'm pretty sure many of you guys know who princess is and what she bring to the table but let's just sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. So if you've been rocking with my channel for a long time, you already know that I have posted previous videos about Princess. One in particular was when she joined the ASU thing at Alabama State University. She joined the team and she actually made the team her first try, which is really, really great and really awesome. But that's expected because y'all know Princess is that girl. But this time around, this year, she did not make the team, guys. And she posted on her YouTube video. She basically was explaining everything of how she felt about not making the team this, this time around. And I want to share this with you guys here. So let's get into that video. So... The first side is more of, I wouldn't even say sad, because I'm not sad about it, but it's just more of a upset, maybe. I don't know what the word would be, because it's just like, you really took something from me that I love. Get what I'm saying? Dance is like my escape. When, I, I, when I'm not in the best state, if I'm not, you know, just not feeling it, I can go dance and it's like forget everything else get what i'm saying so it's more of a like a dang you you really you that's really what you wanted to do so my thing is y'all i'm not even upset i'm not even upset about not not making the team but at tryouts when we were having cuts it's like how did some of these girls surpass me i think we had like two or three cuts i don't even know i think i got cut the second cut so when names were getting called i'm like okay she's steady going down the list steady calling names and she's not saying my name but i'm seeing these girls get up that just i ain't being cocky i'm saying this as as humble as i can but people that just can't touch me like I, I promise y'all I'm saying this in the most humble way because everybody has room for growth but I know talent when I see it I've been dancing for a real long time so for me to just be sitting up there like you steady calling names and I ain't saying my name and you get to the end of the list and it's like my name wasn't called so then it made me wonder like what exactly could y'all be looking for because some of these girls' names that you just called, it's not giving. Like, it's, it's, it's not giving. And I ain't no hater. Like, one thing about me, I'm going to give props when it's due because that's not me. You get what I'm saying? Like, I've never been that way. And I ain't going to start now. But I really feel like they play with me, y'all. They, they really play with me. They really, really play with me. Like, somebody is a hater. And... One thing, one thing I do know is people don't like people that come off confident. I'm not a person that talk a lot. I be in my own world, my own space. But one thing you're going to feel from me is my energy, my vibe. And you're going to know, you're going to know that I'm a very confident person. I'm, I'm very sure about who I am. 
and for some reason that intimidates people like even adults this is something that i've dealt with like all my life adults would come at you and try to make you feel less than when they think you think you all that you get what i'm saying like i ain't gonna say i don't think i'm all that because honestly i do i really do like no games being played i do think i'm all that you get what i'm saying but people don't like that people don't like that i don't know why people people are attracted to people that come off like you know i need this and i need that like i'm not that type of person i don't need you so as you guys can see i did not post the full video but if you guys want to see the full video you are welcome to go to her channel i will put it down in the description down below but I want to know how you guys feel about this. Do you feel like she should have made the team? Like, what's tea? I want to know how you guys feel. Comment down below. Tell me how y'all feel about this. Because I'm just like, wow. Usually, like, not all of the time, but most of the time, most young ladies do make the team if they was already on the team previously. But this is definitely shocking to me, and I know it's shocking to other people. But, y'all, this is the end of the video. Again, if you want to check out the full video, make sure you guys go on her channel and check it out. But that is all for today, and I'll see you guys on the next video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. See ya.